Good morning, Kate. I would call it a hot spot just now. It's quite chilly, uh, but they're hoping it won't rain on their parade here in Weston, where they're celebrating a very special birthday. Yes, this cake uh, represents 10 years of the annual Sand Sculpture Festival. And with up to four times as many Brits choosing a staycation over a vacation, they could have as many as 10,000 guests over the Easter weekend. Now, Alec, if you could just help me down I off this can. cake. Uh, this is Alec. He's <laughs> one of the organisers of the Sand and sculpture festival uh, and you can see these are board games behind us uh, is it all fun and games in weston it definitely is um, our team has been coming to weston supermare for the last 10 years to uh, to build the sand sculptures uh, and i have to say weston has improved massively there's been a lot of new attractions added to weston uh, there's the uh, the pirate adventure there's the wheel there's the uh, sea aquarium there's the grand pier and obviously the sand sculpture festival so i think lots to do for all ages and it's a special year this year isn't it because you've got all the themes from the past 10 years can you talk us through some of these sculptures behind us yeah definitely we're paying tribute to uh, the theme of the last 10 years so uh, there's the where the wild things are the sand sculpture within the the fun uh, uh, the storyline theme um, we also have from the Hollywood team, we have Elsa from the movie Frozen uh, and obviously the very popular uh, Charlie Chaplin, which Rachel is sculpting on right now. OK, thank you very much, Alec. And are you worried, because the holidays abroad are getting cheaper, do you think Brits will start abandoning this and going abroad instead? I don't think uh, we should worry about that at all. We've actually seen an increase in visitor numbers over the last few years and I think a lot of people uh, prefer to uh, go away for a day to the British seaside. OK, thank you very much, Alec. Well, yes, 20 million Brits are expected to go on a day trip over the Easter weekend, getting the kids off the sofa and out having some fun.